Hi guys, today we are going to learn how to create a regression test suit. So what is a regression test suit contains? It will contain the test cases uh, which will give you overall flow of the application. What is the difference between test case sheet like test case we are maintaining for each feature wise and what is the difference between regression test suit means uh, test case uh, will have the test cases for uh, each and every feature levels means user story levels as per agile uh, environment but a regression test suit means uh, overall uh, application level we are maintaining like uh, suppose example uh, we are opening a gmail and we click on sign up button it will open a sign up page first name last name date of birth uh, any email address automatically it will generate and we need to enter our uh, mobile number so we are creating one customer that is kind of a one regression means create the new customer in gmail that is kind of a one all the details we are entering that is kind of a one regression test suit so why we are creating that regression test suit means uh, when we are uh, giving the kt or like a handover to the automation team if you are giving uh, each feature level uh, wise test cases uh, details to the automation they can't understand why because that test cases uh, which is written for each feature level means each button we will write, each label wise we will write and CSS related, uh, anything uh, pop-up related we will write. But uh, based on that automation team or like any other uh, business level can't understand. So that's why like regression test suit when you're writing overall flow we need to write. The flow which will give you the exact idea of the application, how exactly it will work. That flow we need to write in a regression test suit. Based on the regression test suit, uh, what are the repeated tasks uh, which will be identified by the automation team or like sitting together with manual uh, team they will try to understand the, what is the repeated steps for each and every flow for this application based on that they will decide uh, this should be automated and this should be in a manual testing so in this like uh, we'll write the test cases as well as i will map those test cases to defects okay i will try we will try to generate uh, one report so, so that you can uh, show it to the business how exactly the execution is happen and what are the how many test cases are passed, how many test cases are failed, how we will generate the report. This is uh, so here I am just giving one simple example. Suppose uh, if you are Gmail or any application, if you, we need to create the customers first, if it's like the Salesforce applications or anything, they are maintaining the customer uh, related details those will be calls under a lead so those kind of will try to identify verification of uh, new customer creation so here will be prerequisite will be build url should be available right next uh, the steps will be launch application uh, url and uh, so you will be click on uh, create a customer button or like a link if you see link it will be link so enter uh, first name last name dob email as well as like a phone number now fourth step will be click on uh, create button so expect actual result uh, we need to write here for each and every step each and every step we need to write here and uh, what is the expected result means uh, expected results we need to write sorry actual result uh, after execution we have to write so what test data you want to mention you can mention how you can mention first name uh, i want to give as uh, rajesh and uh, last name will be Last name I want to mention, I want to mention as uh, anything you want to mention like uh, Johnson and uh, DOB I want to mention as uh, 1986-08-04 uh, uh, in a US format or any format. So this is a one test case which will uh, create the customer. After creating the customer, I need to update, uh, I need to add the address, address details. Verification of uh, add address. Okay, 
so prerequisite will be build url correct and second will be customer should be available so your steps will be click on uh, add address and uh, second step will be enter uh, line 1 2 comma 3 and uh, state you have to enter pin code city and country so this detail you need to enter and uh, click on uh, add button so what is your uh, expected like expected result uh, address should be added successfully see like uh, if you want to verify any database related you can mention the uh, column if you want to add any database related you can mention here yes i want to insert uh, column left here you will mention database database table you want to mention you can mention so what is it like a uh, customer address related you want to mention anything you can mention otherwise uh, if you want to test only front end you don't need to mention next to test case uh, 3 will be verification of uh, I, I want to update uh, otherwise like uh, I want to add uh, salary details if you want to add salary details uh, click on add uh, occupation before that you need to add the occupation you want to enter uh, company name uh, designation date of uh, you can add a date of join and uh, salary you can add these details and uh, next uh, you need to click on add button after this what will happen uh, so employee uh, you can add the customer means employee also otherwise you can add customer uh, salary details should add it successfully next uh, if you want to uh, add any documentation related you can add verification of uh, documents to be added here i am adding a pan card related so here what you have to do means after adding occupation it will ask some uh, pan card related details or like uh, your address proof details something kind of thing uh, you need to add click on uh, add document uh, button so he will see like uh, now after adding the document button uh, it will uh, show one uh, browse uh, like a uh, one window option you need to select the path select the document path which is available and uh, select the document and uh, what you have to do click on uh, open button in the pop-up you will see click on open button then uh, what will happen uh, the document name should display display in ui right after that uh, you have to click on uh, upload button so once you click on the upload button document will be uploaded and uh, what it will show uploaded now what you have to do you have to verify the document is clearly added or not so documents uh, documents like uh, here how you will add uh, verify not verify after click on the upload button it will add and uh, documents uh, grid documents grid here what you have to do means uh, after adding successful issue documents should display in uh, documents uh, grid or like a widget it will should display yes 
so next uh, what is your eighth step uh, what is your eighth step so document name document name in a document widget so document name should match with uh, uploaded document name that name should be match so next here uh, fifth test case will be now customer is created new customer login credentials everything is generated you email address and phone number are same thing verification of uh, customer login verification of uh, customer login now here prerequisite will be changed build url next uh, your second step will be customer register customer you are like a register customer right what is your steps will be launch apply launch uh, application url second will be click on uh, login uh, button what is your uh, third step uh, enter email address password fourth step will be click on uh, sign in button so here you expected will add if will what is expected so customer account page should display right now what is our test case six now after everything is done you have to write for update scenarios verification of uh, update uh, customer details so build url will be same here it will be same now launch the application is not required abo is already login so go to edit profile right so next what is your edit profile uh, click on uh, edit uh, personal details uh, now what will be your modify first name last name comma dob anything you want to modify you can modify now click on update button right after click on update button what will happen customer first name last name will be updated customer modified fields uh, should reflect properly right in this way like all the test cases we need to write if you see like uh, so first is a very great new customer creation verification of add address add salary details documents to be uploaded and the customer login and after that uh, we are trying to update the details everything then so in this way we have to write uh, each and every flow wise uh, regression test suits and uh, we need to provide the expected result what expected we are using test data you want to add you can add otherwise uh, while you are testing this executing these test cases when you are creating uh, data at that time also you can mention so here i have given some defects uh, which will be mapping to the test case uh, 1 0 5 10 this i have given so if any test case is uh, failed suppose a uh, great new customer is failed so at that time uh, why it is uh, failed means uh, when we click on this uh, create button it is giving a 400 error so that's why i have failed this test case so that test case uh, i have added one defect and i have mapped that test case what is the test case it is failed what is the defect id i have raised and what is the summary when it is raised date is reported and what is the status next here uh, we need to update the status so actual result uh, 400 error so here uh, date when you have tested uh, today is 15 04 2023 what is the status fail status what is the defect 746 so like this uh, you have to mention so like uh, here uh, you can mention that uh, just right click on uh, home uh, conditional formatting I let cell values equal to here you can mention if it is a fail what is the color it should display 
so it is a failed one now now each and every step uh, you have to write verify customer creation uh, here it will be pass and it is a uh, pass next uh, which one is cre after click on create button uh, I have clicked but it is failed it is failed now it will show in this way right in this way like uh, you have to so it is blocked now the customer is not created it is a uh, blocked right so in this way you have to maintain your uh, test irrigation test suits as well as the defects for each and every test case so if you have any doubts like uh, please uh, provide your comments so that i will try to resolve and i will share this uh, document into onedrive uh, sorry like uh, in google drive you can try to download i will provide the link into that uh, video description thank you for watching my video